Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Help Guy and in this video I want to talk to you about on a website that is called uh, Lily Imputing. It says that Ubuntu is going to release a GNOME edition of Ubuntu 12.10 uh, also in October where, you know, Ubuntu 12.10 is going to be released. Now, uh, the GNOME version of Ubuntu is going to be you know, just like what Ubuntu used to be a few years ago. So uh, it's basically going to be uh, Ubuntu without Unity. Now uh, I know, and it also says on the websites uh, I found this on, that you can install the GNOME desktop environment. But uh, what this basically means is that you don't have to download the normal Ubuntu desktop uh, version or the normal Ubuntu OS with Unity. You simply, if you want to use uh, the Ubuntu GNOME version, you can just, you know, uh, download Ubuntu with GNOME. So um, this is very exciting because many people out there uh, hate Unity. And I used to hate Unity, but I don't do that anymore. So I will still be using Unity. The neat thing is that uh, Canonical or basically canonical they um, listened to uh, the users now i want to say if you don't like unity by now uh, there are obviously other versions out there or desktop environments such as kubuntu kde uh, xubuntu with xfce and so on but uh, i think this is a very good thing of canonical a very neat thing of them. Now it also says on this website that along with uh, the GNOME desktop environment and the, the user interface that you will have different applications such as um, instead of uh, LibreOffice and uh, Firefox you will have uh, Epiphany and Abbey Word uh, if you install the GNOME version. So basically the only changes um, from Ubuntu with Unity and the Ubuntu with GNOME is that you don't get Unity and also the applications are a bit different, some of the applications at least. So um, again, Ubuntu, Ubuntu Software Center on uh, Unity, um, but you might see the GNOME package kit system uh, for installing and updating apps and downloading apps on uh, the GNOME version of Ubuntu. So the only thing about this is that they are not really clear uh, about what the operating system is going to be called. You know, the Ubuntu with GNOME. So um, what they call it so far is uh, GNOME Ubuntu, but uh, they might change that in the future. So the question I have for you guys is, do you think that this is a good idea with um, Ubuntu basically leaving you with two choices, either Unity or GNOME? Do you think this is a good good idea? I think it's a very, very nice idea and I really support this idea. I'll include this website with the information down in the description and please do leave a comment um, telling me what your opinions are on this matter. So uh, that's it. Have a nice day and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Girl Scout.